So we don't need any more fanfare in front of the camera with nothing helping black and brown people in their violence. I saw a great commercial about those bills, but nine, ten people were shot last night. Those bills will not help them. We put forward a plan because there are things we can do to help with this violence. And we've been working on these for years. So when I asked for a billion dollars to be put in a budget to help this community address gun violence, victim services, we continue to lift up our victims to pass bad policy, but you don't attend to what they need. And youth services, we didn't get it. We got a billion dollars for a stadium that's not even built in the city that has the problem. It's not about a press, I'm tired of going from press conference to That's funeral. Right. That's right. Right. Say it, say it again. Say it again. Say it again. We say know again. what worked and we've been asking you for it. Right. As a matter of fact, in 2012, as the co-chair of the Task Force to Combat Gun Violence, we put out a report that got the first seed funding for many of these groups here. Yeah. They told us it could not be done. We had stopped more young black men that actually lived in the city of New York and it wasn't working. We said we have a plan. Let's get these resources. Yes. Yes. We lowered the stops. We lowered use of force from, from cops. Yes. We lowered people complaining about use of force. And we lowered shootings and murders from 2012 to 2018, 2019. Right. We know what works. That's right. There was a plan to build out an infrastructure. And let me be clear, our law enforcement partners, we want them to do their job with transparency and accountability. These communities deserve for their taxpayers to have that service. What's missing is every damn thing else. These folks are fighting for eight hour shifts when this violence is happening 24 hours a day. If there's an agency that can get unlimited overtime, where is the money for everybody else? That's all we're asking. Please. We're tired of the death, black and brown death. If you can find some bills, if you can sign some bills and make a commercial, get some resources here to stop this violence. Because our people are dying and we're tired of it. And they look like me and the people mourning look like my mother. This is not about a race. This is not about theoretical for me. I can name you the people who died when I was in high school from gun violence. And we're still here. Please, I'm begging you. Those of you who know how best to win elections, please know how best to help communities. I beg of you, because we're tired. And the things we know we're going to be at another press conference very soon. So what are we going to do in between those two press conferences?